Hello everyone, your favorite CPA, Jim Baker here, and I wanna make a video today about WhatsApp for business, why you need it, why you might not need it, and how to use it. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. So Haven't WhatsApp business taxes, is the same as, well, first of all, if you don't know what WhatsApp is, it's a major messaging tool owned by Facebook, I believe. They bought it for a billion dollars. It's the most popular messaging tool in the world, and it's extremely popular in different parts of the world, like South America, like I, I mentioned in my other videos. South, I use WhatsApp kind of with almost all of my clients who are a lot, the majority of my clients are from South America, from you know different countries in South or Latin America, I guess Central America as well. And I communicate with them, almost all of my clients with WhatsApp. My WhatsApp is always busy, but I love it for a lot of different reasons. and the new tools with WhatsApp for business that I've been using for the last um, couple months are just incredible. And I'm not even using all the tools, but the, what I've found already and what I am using are really great. And um, I use WhatsApp business on my, on my, on my Google phone, which I like it more in the Android provider personally than on the iPhone, but it works on the iPhone as well. And I'm actually going to do the screen share with my iPhone showing how I use WhatsApp and showing my profile off a little bit. Although, uh, it might be a little bare since I don't really use WhatsApp business on my iPhone and I'm only going to use it for um, just really the purpose of this video. I usually use it on my Android phone and the one thing that I don't know how to do that well on the Android phones is screen record. Unless maybe between finishing this commentary and picking up my phone, I figure it out. Um, in any case, WhatsApp business, if you're trying to get more clients, it's a great tool because you can organize it's like a crm tool that's free and it's in your phone and it's sharing your number and it's um a great way to just connect with your clients and talk to your clients so i'm going to uh go to my um my phone now and tell you a little bit about it and show you how i use it okay hello everyone so i'm recording my screen now and i want to go through my iphone and show you how to use and how i use really whatsapp business in english right so um, you know, you download WhatsApp business. Here's regular WhatsApp on the bottom, and this is WhatsApp business. I agree and continue. I have to enter in my phone number, 305. Three, uh, two, this, three, this is my personal phone, so I appreciate my video team can hide this phone number, 240245. Okay, done. Okay, so... Um, logging in, you have to use your phone number. So you can only have, if you have a phone, you can't have WhatsApp and WhatsApp business. You can only have one per phone number. I can't have, um, I can't have WhatsApp and WhatsApp business with the same number. You have to use one or the other. Okay. So you edit your profile. I'm going to leave that picture. It's fine. You put your business name, James Baker is my business name. My category is going to be in education. Done. So now we're we're in the WhatsApp um, business profile. Okay, cool. Um, my chats. I only have one chat. I was added to my family chat. Cool. So we go to the settings, and here you get your business settings. You can do your whole profile. You can add a business description, your hours, your address, your email address, your website, and a little bit about you. Right. You can add all these things, and that's helpful a catalog of your services and products so that people can choose things and actually buy from you using WhatsApp, like a actual store. A short link. The short link is amazing because you can you can have your default message say, hey, saw you on Instagram. And you add this into your Instagram stories so that you can, um, so like when someone clicks on a story and clicks on this this link in your WhatsApp, then it's going to go directly to um, it's going to open up their WhatsApp and open up a new message to your phone number. So it's a great way to just send leads. If, if someone's interested in talking to you, they click the button, it, it opens their WhatsApp with a pre-prepared message to talk to you. So it's going to send. And you know, the, it's a big trend now. Gary Vaynerchuk's doing it. People sharing their their um, cell phone numbers because that, that way they can... Um, uh, you know, get more clients, right? They're, and I'm sure they have extra private cell phones. Like this is actually my personal cell phone. I use my WhatsApp business on my 
Google phone. I like the Android phones a lot still. I use both. So we have the short link. The labels are awesome. And I'm going to show you how to use the labels in action. But basically, when you have people coming into your business, if you want to organize them based on stages and make sure, like, if you have a hot lead and someone you want to close, you label them as um, new customer or maybe we'll add something like um, prospect to close. Great. So we have prospect to close in all these ugly colors. Let's, let's change this color. Can we edit this label? Edit this. The color. Let's make this green. The color of money. Save. Okay. So back. So we have prospect to close. Back. And then we have linked accounts. You can link your Facebook page. That's fine. I already have my link to my other account. Messaging tools here are awesome. And, and really all the tools of WhatsApp business are in the settings. Um, I want to show you. So with the messaging tools, you can have away messages. So whenever like people will text you and you're not using your phone, they'll get an away message. That's you know pretty simple. A greeting message, when you turn on when people message you the first time, they'll get a greeting message. It's automatic. The quick, the quick replies is the gold. So um, the quick replies are amazing. And the labels, that's really what I use the most. Having a, a profile and a catalog are cool, but as a business owner, as someone who's doing the sales myself, the linked accounts, I don't know, the, the labels and the quick replies, is that's where the gold is in WhatsApp business. And again, this is free. So if you have a business, do it this way. It's, it makes so much sense. So um, you have your labels and you have your quick replies, right? So um, you add a new quick reply every time uh, you need to make a, a template message to send people. Because if you are in business and you're delivering a certain service, I imagine you get similar questions over and over. So this is how you send a quick reply. You can see my YouTube video explaining it here. And then you have YouTube.com, whatever. Right, and let's see if we can make that a hyperlink. Can we do that? No, I think it'll do it automatically. So we'll do this as YouTube video invite, whatever, this is just for me. Um, YouTube video invite, you can attach media if you want as well, a video or a picture. Probably a smaller media would be better. So we save that quick reply, and that's amazing, so we're back. So we went through it all, let's go to our, so like the status, I think is the same. Calls, basically the same. Uh, camera cancel basically the same it's a camera whatever and then the chats now this is it so I'm gonna add Jim Baker on here Jim Baker this is my business profile so I, I have Jim Baker and I'm going to send him a message I'm gonna send him this you press backslash and then it brings up all your quick replies right so I'm gonna click that one and send it to him this is how you send a quick reply and I see it on my phone that I just got a message from myself, right? So um, the quick reply is awesome. Now we have Jim here. Let's long click on it. Oh, I slide it to the right, and you can archive it if you want, but I'm not doing that. It's an active prospect. So more, I'm going to click on the more key, and I'm going to label the chat. And from here, Jim is a prospect to close. So I'm going to do that. So now it says prospect to close, and I know that he's a prospect. And again, this is just me. So if I want to pin this, I can pin it. So now it's locked to the top. And if I have a million chats on my on my actual WhatsApp business, I have a million chats going on. This will always be at the top because it's someone I want to close, right? So um, let's go to broadcast lists. You can make lists to send out um, messages to all uh, a bunch of clients all at once. So I'm going to add Jim. I'm going to add... Dan, add my dad, I'm going to add my brother, John, great, okay, so I'm going to create this list, and now messages I send to this list are secured, and that's fine, so um, I can send everyone a message at the same time, they will only get the broadcast if they, um, list name, encryption, they'll only get it if, um, what's the word, if they have my number saved in their phone, right otherwise they won't get it and um edit done and that's how you write a new message fine so the broadcast list is something i haven't used yet i want 
WhatsApp to make it so when I I can broadcast make make a broadcast list out of labels, right? So when I have my I want to be able to make a broadcast list out of this. Edit cancel. Okay. So I want I, I want that to happen. Other than that, um, everything's amazing because I can go to um okay, so this is the settings again, business settings, start messages, WhatsApp desktop. So those were the business settings. Now we have the rest of the settings here. Starred messages or messages that, that you saved for whatever reason. WhatsApp web, desktop, that's if you want to use WhatsApp on your computer. Your account details, you know, I would definitely recommend two-step verification. You go to your chats, save to camera roll, you can back up your chat, you can clear, you can delete, whatever. Obviously, notifications are what they are. Data and storage usage, you can say how you're going to operate. Um, what's help? I guess they have information for it. And then what's tell a friend? I guess uh, you can just email to share this to other people. So really, that's it. It's not that much different. It's actually very, very, very similar to free WhatsApp. To, I mean, not to free, but to regular WhatsApp. But there's so many great tools that you can use to, um, uh, you know, reach out to your clients and just save a ton of time and keep people organized. It's basically a CRM autoresponder built into a regular messaging app that we use every day so that's basically that's basically it for this right so um let me know if you have any questions below and uh i'm happy to uh, answer any questions or give more examples here and thank you oh there you go that's, that's what i want to do scroll down if you scroll down from the top then you can see your labels and you can look at all the people all the people in the labels right so let's scroll down more now we can look at everyone in the label. So you can see all the prospects you have and message them all at once. That's what I was looking for. Right? You just have to pull it down. Okay. So that's 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 another way to really use the, the tagging tool. So let me know if you thought this was helpful. I think it's a really great tool. And if you have a business, you should definitely be using WhatsApp business.